a very good international, a very typically American expression would be, sure. Hey, can I get one of those? Sure. Sure basically means yes and softens up the way you speak. If you went to a restaurant and you needed a chair from somebody else's table, uh, excuse me, is this chair free? Yeah, sure. You want to go for a coffee? Yeah, sure. It's quite American, but it's also used in uh, most other English speaking countries too. Sure. Yeah. Aye. Aye, aye, aye. Aye is a very historical word which in Scots, which was the traditional um, language of Scotland before the English decided that they would uh, impose themselves culturally. Um, in the Scots dialect, I, and in many Northern English dialects, I means yes. It's become very cool to use on internet and social media instead of saying yes. Um, I lad, meaning yes, my friend. Um, it's also a similar thing is used in the Houses of Parliament to agree and express your accord or your agreement over a public debate. Aye, aye, aye. Aye, aye, Captain. Please do. Please do is a beautiful expression. If you're an Italian speaker, you, you could probably substitute this for prego. Great is one of the most common words in English, many different applications, many different meanings. And great in this context would mean yes, I would love to. I would love to, in fact, would be another way of saying it. So, you come into the party, great would mean yes, I am, will do. Will do is another slightly humorous way of saying, yes, I will do it, which basically means yes. So, bring the uh, paper over to me, will do. That's all for today, folks. See you soon. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel.